Hi, this video tutorial is about finding documents that have been shared with you using Google Apps. You might be informed that something has been shared with you, whether it be an administrator or another teacher or even a student, but you're not sure where it is and you really want to get to that document. So what do you do? How do you get to it? Well, I'm going to take you to the Google Drive and show you exactly where the document should be. So first and foremost, you want to go to drive.google.com. And then you're presented with a sign-in page. So what this tutorial deals with is the BASDschools.org. Uh, Google Apps domain for Bethlehem Area School District. So what I'm going to be saying is specific for that, but generally it can apply to even a consumer account. If someone has uh, shared something with your Gmail or personal uh, Google Apps account. But for the purposes of this tutorial, we're dealing with our school account. So you want to sign in. Um, so staff members, it's your username you usually have with your email and it's at BASDschools.org with your email address. Click on sign in. If you are signed in with your consumer account, you just want to go to the upper right hand corner um, and either sign out of that account and then sign into the BASD Schools account or click on add account so that you can sign into that account as well. Okay, so I'm taking it to my drive. And these are all of my documents that I have been uploading or creating in my Google Drive. And the reason I know that I'm there is because it says My Drive on the left hand side and it's kind of lit up in orange. So that's sort of telling me where I'm at. If I wanted to access documents that have been shared with me, I would click on Shared with Me and then a whole other set of documents uh, appear. These are all things that have been shared with me at one time or another. And it could be someone specifically sharing with me, like one person, or it could be uh, someone who has shared a document with a group of people. Uh, whatever the case, it will be in this area. And I can see uh, when it was shared with me, who owns that document, um, and um, also the title of the document. So. When someone says that they shared a document with you, it's a good idea to find out approximately what the title of it should be um, in case that they've been sharing a lot of things with you because you may have to uh, take a look for it. But chances are, um, if you click on share date and you sort by share date, so I could sort by title of document or I can sort by the share date. Um, these are the things that have been the most recently shared. It should appear toward the top if it was just shared with you. So that's basically it. That's how to find something. You can um, add it to your drive. So say um, here's a folder that um, Joanne Christofik has shared with me. If I wanted to see it in my drive area and not have to go there, I could click on the check mark and click on add to my drive. Okay. Um, but keep, uh, be very wary or cautious when you do this, um, especially if you do this with something that's inside a folder um, and you have the permission to make changes. Sometimes it actually takes it out of the folder. Um, so you could generally do this with um, documents that have been shared with you. Uh, just be cautious when doing it with things that are inside a folder. And that's it. That's how to find things shared with me. Thanks.